Good morning from Kandalim, Goa. My name is Ivana or Miranam Iwanehe and we're off to the beach again. The camera got wet. I died a little inside because there was this massive wave and it just, you know, rolled over the bag and I was like, not the camera, not the camera. So the camera was all wet, but luckily it was just a screen. The water didn't get inside the camera. Bless you, Lord, bless you. My God, God is real. I was like, no, no, we cannot do this. Anyways, it was so much fun at the beach. I got freshened up. Um, it is the afternoon, it is time for lunch. So let's go walk around for a bit and look for a dosa because I really, really want to eat a mud flipping dosa. Do you know how long it's been since I ate a mud flipping dosa? Yes, mud flipping dosa. Ah, chala chala. This is hilarious. Look at this cow having a feast. <laughs> I love the cows in Goa, man. They are so peaceful. So nice. Look at that. <laughs> This just looks too funny, man. Yo, squad goals. <laughs> I love them. They're so cute. Still not touching them, though. Boom. Oh, where are you going? Oh, baby cow. <gasps> You're so cute. You're so cute. I've asked the guys from the guest house where I can find a uh, dosa. Hello, <laughs> And I got a place which is about two and a half kilometers away. So it's gonna be a nice walk and the reward is going to be a dosa. I wanted to show you this yesterday, but I had a crappy camera with a scratch with me. So this is a massive mangrove, man. Can you see that puppy over there? Can you see the car? Can you see how huge this is? I love the nature in Goa, man. It's again very different from what I've seen before. Yes, found the Dosa Plaza. Bring it on. Ordered something questionable, but I was like, this is new. Let me try it. So this is masala, no, no, Mexican roast dosa. So we got some peppers over here and onions, sambar. Eh, should I try it? Should I try it again? I don't know. This is probably tomato chutney and uh, coconut chutney. So let's do this. Let me try. Okay, wait, let's start here. I don't know what. I don't even know what. It, oh, what is it? I think it's filled with paneer. I'm not sure. Okay, wait. Let's just. Oh, look at that. That looks delicious, doesn't it? Yes, I like those close-up shots of food too. <laughs> okay, let's try it with a coconut chutney first. Dip it, dip it. When dosa plaza surprises you. Super crispy. Love it. It definitely does have that Mexican flavor. This is delicious actually. Wait, let me try some more. Um, actually, let me try the samba. Should I just keep trying it? No, not this one. Too much hinge, I guess, or a pasta or something. No. We have some more. Actually, I like the vegetables. That's so nice. Actually, recently, I've had a massive preference for the tomato chutney, I have to say. I don't know why. This is damn fine, I have to say. You need to try this. So this place is called Dosa Plaza. Hashtag non-spawn. I'm just helping you out, my friends. And it's in between Kandulim and Kalangut. Why am I, what am I doing? Wait, let me properly turn. A bit off the wall. So many veggies inside. This is good. Especially with the tomato chutney. It's, it's, it's definitely Mexican-y. And with that, I mean, it definitely has that Mexican flavor. But it's still Indian, but it's also Mexican, but it's still Indian, but it's also Mexican. Bodosa Plaza. Almost 4.30, currently walking back because I actually was so slow that I should have back now. I am 
just looking for a little dessert. Just found dessert. I haven't had this in such a long time. When you just mentioned you gained weight and then you eat bourbon because bourbon doesn't count, damn it. Bourbon doesn't count. Also, jelly pop and candy chocolate doesn't count. <laughs> no. I tell you, better than Oreo. Winner combo. It is 5 p.m. having masala chai. It smells so good with bourbon. This, this is just the winner combo. The best. The thing is, I wasn't even gonna have tea. But then I found this super cute place. So much green. And it is called, what is it called? Coffee Tree, Coffee House, Candle Limb. It's next to the road, but I really, really enjoy it. So I thought, hey, let's have some tea here because it's tea time. Look at this doggo. Look at this cute doggo. Yes, you are absolute sweetheart. I would love to pet you, but, but I have to eat and I don't want to make my hands dirty. Oh, you should do it, boo. You should do it, boo. Cutie pie. Those begging doggo eyes, though. <laughs> I have to be firm. I have to be firm. This is not good for doggos anyway. Uh, I'm not dipping it in the tea. I know a lot of people like to do that, but the thing is, I'm team crunchy. You have team chewy, the people who like the chewy cookies, and team crunchy. I like my cookies crunchy, or biscuits, whatever you want to call them. Oh. Good masala chai. Guess who has 4G now? Not just 3G. Not just no reception, no, 4G, wait, focus camera, focus, 4G, boom, boom, apparently it was an option on my phone, 4G, winning a life, and, and, guess who's answering comments, yes. Somebody said, Ivana, you're slacking, it's true, but can I blame the Wi-Fi, like seriously, for me, like, I love to answer comments, love it, love it, love it, but if I can't even properly WhatsApp, can you imagine how hard it is to answer comments? I love you guys for it. I love you and I try to answer as many comments as possible. I'm sorry. What can I say? This this is this is my I'm sorry. These these wonderful doggo eyes. Sorry. I hope you still like me. Oh by the way, in case you are very eager for a reply, of course I love replying to all of the comments, but I simply can't. There are too many. Uh, but if you really want to reply in the morning, that's when I usually reply to all of the people who were like uh, first to the video. Not not first first, but like usually in the morning when the vlog is just up, when it's just published, that's your best chance to get a reply. Time for another meal. And you won't hear me say this very often, but I wasn't that hungry. <laughs> so I just ordered veg munchao soup. I've never tried it. And I was just wondering what it tastes like. If this looks like Manchurian uh, gravy, but then with water, with more water. Yes, let me try something new. Okay. Don't know what this is gonna be like. Never tried it. It's like the Manchurian gravy, but with more water. <coughs> and spicy. I love maturing. This is like a little bit strange. So sleepy, but the Wi Fi was lit. So I got a lot of work done. It is 1.30 a.m. now and I'm off to sleep. Tomorrow we're not going to the beach because I got a really bad sunburn. I don't know. Oh yeah, can you see that? Yeah, it's a really bad sunburn. Look at this, look at this. Ivana was being dumb, not bringing her sunscreen stuffs and stuffs. Stuffs and stuffs, yes. That, that would be the name of a shop if I ever have one. Stuffs and stuffs. <laughs> Maybe paneer stuffs and stuffs. <laughs> <laughs> that would be pretty cool, right? Well, I found two sweets. This is a uh, dos or something and uh, this bibinka. This looks damn fine. Can't wait to try it. Anyways, if you would like to travel along and explore more of Goa with me, click that subscribe button. And if you like this vlog, put a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!